Hi there, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at the new Onkyo G3 Active Speaker with Google Assistant built in. Now the G3 comes in two finishes. There's the all white finish, or alternatively you've got a choice of the dark gunmetal grey front and back with the black wrap. Now the physical connections on the back of the G3 are really simple. An AC power lead and a micro USB connection. That's it. Everything else is done wirelessly. Now the controls on the G3 are really simple. Across the top we've got a play pause button, a Bluetooth button allowing you to connect to a smart device, the microphone mute, volume up and down, and then right at the top you can see the two small microphones which are listening for the voice activation. I think it's about the right time to cover a few more specifications for you. So the outside dimensions of the G3, it's 168mm tall, 120mm wide, and 123 millimeters deep and it only weighs 2.4 kilos but the most important feature of this g3 is the google assistant which is actually built in so i think it's time i show you how to set the unit up and get everything running so first things first we need to plug it into the power and it needs to set itself up for this first connection if you haven't already done so go to the app store or the play store and download the google home app you're going to need this to actually set up the G3 speaker. Now that's done, we can actually get started. If you haven't already got a Gmail account, you will need to set one up because this is actually very critical to the whole way the G3 system works with Google. Now the app will automatically go searching for devices. Now depending what the position of the systems are, it can take a little while or alternatively it can be very, very quickly. Just a little bit of patience is needed, and there we go. The app has now found the G3. Once the app has successfully found the G3, you'll hear a sound through the speaker. Then you just need to confirm that that is correct. Then we can move on to actually naming the room or where the speaker is actually going to live. I'm going to call it the den. I'm just going to confirm that and press next. Now, if this is the first G3 you've got for your system, then you will actually need to go in and put your normal Wi-Fi password in once you've actually selected from the list of Wi-Fi networks it's actually found around you. Now this part is actually self-explanatory and I've actually covered up my password so you can't see it. I've hit enter and it will now actually connect to your standard Wi-Fi which has internet access. And this is where we need just a little bit of patience because it can actually take some time for the G3 to connect to your wireless network. And there we go, we're now actually connected and we move on to the next stage. Just thought I'd mention that if you haven't already got a Google account or Gmail, then it's probably best that you actually set one up before you set up this particular speaker. I'd just like to say at this point in the video, you would normally teach the Google Assistant part of the G3 for your voice. I've already done this previously on the white G3, so you only actually have to do it once, and it covers all of the speakers in your entire system. Once we've done the voice training, we can move on to the next section, and this is where it'll actually bring up your address through the Wi-Fi and the GPS in your smart device. Once that's done, we can actually move on to the music services. If you either have Spotify or Google Play, they do have free trials available if you want to go for that or not. Now your next page is really just a summary of everything that's been done. Your address, the device, and the Wi-Fi you're connected to. Once you hit OK, it'll actually transfer all the information to the G3 speaker and update. But this, as it says, can take up to three to four minutes. And now the G3 is all set up and ready to go with the Google Assistant. We can ask Google some questions. Hey Google, what's the weather like today? It's 3 degrees and cloudy. It'll be cloudy with the forecast high of 3 and the low of 2. Well, I think that wraps up the first look and the setup guide to the new G3 speaker from Onkyo with the Google Assistant that's built in. I hope you've enjoyed watching. If you have, please like and subscribe to the channel. You can also track us down on Twitter or find us on Facebook. Take care. Bye-bye.